Hello and welcome to Eva's House of Spirit. I'm Eva and today we're going to do something a little bit fun. Um, I am going to do the what's in my bag tag posted by Lisa the Pagan. And I also saw Derry Carpenter. Uh, she answered Lisa back as well. So I'm going to have links to their uh, videos, their what's in my bag videos. But I'm going to do the what's in my bag right now, too. And here's my bag. Got this at a yard sale. Yes, it is at Donna Karen, but I did not pay, like, crazy designer price. I think I think I paid something like $3 for it or something like that. But anywho, um, let's get on into my bag and see what the hell do I even carry around with me. And it's constantly changing. This isn't always the same because sometimes I will go through my stuff and I will take things out and change what's in there. So anyway, let's see what's in here. Um, let's see, I have Avon Skin So Soft Renew and Refresh Age Defying Overnight Hand Treatment. Because ladies, your hands always show your age. So... I'd like to put this on at night to make my hands look all young. I just keep it in my purse because that way I always know where it is. Um, I have my Pink Sweet Pea Fantasy Purse Spray. I have my checkbook. I have my little floral Aluma Wallet. <laughs> These are actually supposedly really cool because uh, people that do that identity theft where they like scan your wallet in your pocket, like they can't do it through aluminum. So that's a good thing to have, you know, just in case because, hey, you never know. Not like I am dripping with money, but hey, I'm going to make them work for it if they're going to try to steal my money, right? Um, let's see. I have like a gold glittery lip gloss um i forget what company this is by the color is called victoria oh it's elf shimmer gloss that's what it is and it's uh it's like a gold shimmery gloss it doesn't really have much of a color it just it goes on it looks kind of sheer but it has a very delicate shimmer to it that's nice um have my Nivea cream. This stuff is awesome for like your hands in the winter or like, you know, um, sometimes if you get uh, like those dry spots on your face from like the dry air in the winter. I know that Nivea is a little thick. You can add a little water to it in your hand before you kind of apply it. But this is really good for like super, super dry skin. It's good for your knees, your elbows. Um, even your cuticles, whatever, if you wash your hands a lot like I do, this stuff is awesome. It really is. Um, it can also be used as a night cream, but if you're real sensitive and you break out, I would say cut it with some water and don't put it on full strength. Um, and, and another tr tip too I wanted to share on that subject, if you wanted to do like a tinted moisturizer type of deal, you could take a tiny like a dot of this and a little bit of your, of your foundation your liquid foundation, you can mix that in your hand and you could actually apply that like a tinted moisturizer. You know, if you don't own a tinted moisturizer but you want that little bit of, um, of color going on. Sometimes you just need that sheer coverage. Uh, what else do I have? Let's see, I have an envelope um, from a card that someone gave me and I have some notes for a video that I was going to make. I have another envelope from a card that someone sent me for Christmas um, with some doodles on it where I was doing some math to calculate my money, what was in my account. 
I have some receipts from the store because I always try to keep track of what the hell I spend so I know where I'm at so I don't go under. <coughs> I have uh, a little piece of paper again where I did a bunch of math and like made little notes. Another receipt. I have a broken candy cane. Um, at my job they were giving us out some candy canes and I grabbed a whole fistful of them. I have coupons for Wendy's. <laughs> Not that I really go to Wendy's, but sometimes if I have a coupon, you know, and it's like one of those nights you don't want to cook, hey, Wendy's, you know. <laughs> um, I have a lip treatment. It's like a, a, a moisturizing, like, lip balm. I forget the, the company that makes that, but it's sold at Walmart. It's like, uh, I think, geared toward, like, like tweens and teens and then this one is cute it has little owls it's like an environmental makeup line it's got little owls going around the the top and I thought I just love owls so I was like okay I like that stuff and it smells nice and it does the trick so you know I bought it like in clearance or something I have my body fantasies pink sweet pea fantasy lotion um Let's see, I have a green Crayola <laughs> marker in my purse. Um, I often use colored markers when I write up my, um, my tarot readings for people, so sometimes I'll have like the colored markers like just thrown in my bag. Uh, let's see, some more candy canes. Um, I have a little pouch of crystals. A pair of scissors. <laughs> um, I have the most random things in here. I have some gum, extra uh, long-lasting flavor, polar ice. <coughs> uh, let's see. I have my little skeleton pen with little jewel eyes. I have... Yet another candy cane. Um, what else do I have here? Oh, here's two more candy canes. Yeah, I grabbed like a fistful of these things. Um, a bunch of pens. Another marker. A brown Crayola marker. Got my pens. Because you know what? I, I write and I write and I write. Um, let's see. I have more more pens, one of which is like a, you know, those ink, like the um, felt tip pens. I like those for when I do readings as well because uh, when I scan the, the pages that I write out, the, those felt tip pens, they, um, they soak into the paper better so there's not like an indentation from the strokes of what I've written and it doesn't reflect back, it actually scans really good. So I, I tend to use that a lot. I have an Eon Smoke e-cigarette. Um, I have a Nika K lip shine, um, like lip gloss and taupe. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> I have a, a green apple chapstick. Excuse me, I have to close out. This stupid thing keeps popping up. Um, this, I have a green apple chapstick, uh, which is kind of nice. Oh, what do you know? More candy canes. Can you tell I'm big on peppermint sometimes? Um, I have a glue stick. <laughs> I have part of another candy cane. It's like a... Um, these are like those Jolly Rancher ones that are like like fruit flavored, I think. Or maybe if it wasn't Jolly Rancher, it might have been, um, what do they call those other candies? Those like spree candies, I forgot what they call them. Uh, oh, a little tiger's eye stone that fell out of my pouch of stones. I have, what else? Oh, yet another glue stick. Some band-aids. Um... A mini bonbons flavored lip gloss. It's like a shimmery, like 
violet colored gloss but it doesn't look violet when you put it on your lips it's kind of sheer but it has a little bit of shimmer um i have an anemone board because you never know when you're going to chip a nail and you got to fix that before it becomes a full-on like crack all the way down your nail i have a binder clip and yet another glue stick <laughs> i'm big on glue sticks always crafting i have a fortune cookie fortune that says the best the best exercise for the heart is to reach down and help someone up. That's a very very cute little thing. I kind of had that in my bag. Let's see what else. Um, got three Ricola cough drops. <coughs> I have. I have. I have. I'm trying to untangle it before I show you. Come on, untangle. I have my pink glow-in-the-dark rosary that I carry around with me. I just kind of keep that with me because I feel uh, it's sort of protective for me. Uh, it's like a talisman. I also have my calorie shells. I keep them with me everywhere I go. Um, what else? Is this pocket done? Yeah, this pocket's done. I have a paper clip and yet another pen. Um, now we're going to go into the second pocket. I have a pocket pack of tissues in there. I have the most random stuff in there. I have my, my detangling hairbrush. It's got the nice wide teeth so you can use it when your hair is wet. But it's good also if you have hair like mine that is like baby fine and tangles up a lot. If you have like those, you know, sometimes the, the boar hair bristle brushes, well, they're good with like for dispersing the oils in your hair. These with the wide teeth like this, they help to undo like tangles. My hair tangles like you wouldn't believe. I can just brush it out and like two seconds later it's all tangled up again. But this helps me to work them out, you know, from working from the bottom up without ripping half of my hair out. And again, it can be used when your hair is wet because it's got the wide teeth too. So it's just a nice versatile, versatile uh, brush to have. And I have another candy cane, another uh, like fruity flavored candy cane. Um, and I have more extra gum. This one is extra peppermint. And I have another candy cane. <laughs> fruit flavor candy cane because you know when I work um, sometimes what helps me not to haul off and punch someone in the face is to have a little bit of candy to eat you know it keeps you kind of in a good mood when you work in retail you kind of need to keep your spirits up so you know that's what works for me I mean you know some of you out there hey maybe sugar's not your thing you know and that's cool but that's what it's what works for me is when I want to like deck somebody because it's getting like really stressful i just like have a piece of candy puts me in a much better mood i have some uh instant ginger tea powder this is like um a chinese ginger tea it's like instant you just put this in the hot water and you just drink it you don't need to add the sugar it's kind of like the concept of instant coffee but this is instant ginger tea and it is definitely um, potent. It does definitely uh, work. And I have this little thingy here. It's actually a mirrored compact. And it also has a pop-out hairbrush, which needs a cleaning really bad. I almost feel embarrassed that I showed that to you. I haven't actually used that one in a while. It's just kind of been sitting around my purse. I have 40 carats BB cream, and that one is uh, in light to medium. I have um, from the balm, spelled B A L M, the balm, their Plump Your Pucker tinted gloss. Uh, this one is in Tutti My Fruity. This one, it kind of makes like your mouth more plump. It has that stuff in it that kind of almost makes your lips tingle. And it makes poof out. <coughs> Excuse me, it makes them poof out a little. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> um, 
Then I have another ELF Shimmer Gloss. This one is called just in pink. And it's like it's like a pink gloss with some delicate shimmer in there. This damn window for optimum Wi-Fi keeps freaking popping up. And I swear to God, I'm getting annoyed by it. Sorry, folks. Um, what else do we have here? Another Tiger's Eye Stone. Popped out of my bag with the little stones. <sighs> Yet another candy cane, folks. Um, got my phone charger. <coughs> An open pocket pack of tissues. Oh, from when I had a cold. ShopRite brand nasal decongestant. <coughs> <clears throat> I have an envelope from a card where I wrote some little notes on the top margin. I usually use envelopes like that are used for scrap paper instead of using a fresh piece of paper and just wasting paper like that. I'll just kind of like, you know, grab what's there and just kind of doodle on it. A brand new deodorant that I just bought because my other one expired. Um, not expired. It was used up. And uh, I like to use Speed Stick. Because, while it's more of a guy scent, um, this actually has more of a soapy scent. But I don't like to wear antiperspirant, because in a lot of antiperspirants, they put that uh, aluminum... I forget what, it's like some kind of aluminum derivative, and that's not actually good for you to absorb into your skin. There's um, evidence to support that it may later in your life lead to uh, Alzheimer's disease and other... Um, forms of dementia and like uh, sort of cognitive decline. So I try to stay away from um, you know that aluminum derivative that is an antiperspirant and I only buy just deodorant. I know that Arm & Hammer makes um, just deodorants that are nice too. Um, I just, I go with the speed stick. It tends to be pretty cheap. Usually you can get it for like a buck or two. Um, and there's, I think there's one or two other brands, or even the deodorant crystals are good to use, but uh, I, I don't like the antiperspirant slash deodorant. I just use the deodorant. Hey, um, it works for me. There's certain days that sometimes I'll run into the bathroom after a few hours, like after half of the day. Maybe I'll reapply a little, put a little perfume, you know, but I've never had anybody be like, damn, girl, you smell. So apparently <laughs> it works, and I do, I do legitimately work. Like, I will work up a sweat. Frost, why are you meowing? You hear my cat? Hey, buddy, stop that. Get away from that door. Stop. He's trying to get into the bedroom. He's being a bad boy. Okay, um, what else do I have in my bag? Some more band-aids. I have a receipt here from getting Chinese food. Um, I have some coupons from my local supermarket. I have another e-cigarette, um, some pencils, another enamel board, a pencil sharpener. I have a Crayola marker in purple. I have another glue stick, <laughs> <coughs> and I have um, this is Wet and Wild. Uh, it's tinted moisturizer in their. It's number 183 Sun Kissed, and the label's like half worn off, but this stuff, I swear by this, it works really good for me. Um, I have another Crayola marker, this time a fat marker in brown. I have another Ricola cough drop. What else is in the bottom in here? I have my Altoids. I have my hours from work. I have another glue stick. Oh my god, me and the glue sticks. I got my car keys and house keys. And uh, let's see, let's see. I got also a paper clip. And I think this is the shopping list. Yeah, this is the shopping list I took to the store today. Is there anything else in here? Um, yeah, in this other pocket, I have some more receipts and band aids. The reason why I carry so many band-aids, by the way, is because sometimes, like, if I break a nail or crack a nail and I don't have time to fix it, 
Um, I mean, a crack that goes beyond, like, something you can kind of file down and save. Like, if it's not a superficial crack, if it's, like, a deep crack or if my nail pops off, I will wrap my finger with a Band-Aid while I'm at work and just keep working. And then when I come home, I'll soak off the rest of the nail, you know, because most of my nails are natural, but these three here, one, two, three, are fake, and this one is fake. I didn't want to trim all of my nails off because... You know, why would I have all the nails fake and have to do them all, all the time when some of them are naturally, you know, naturally there and they're not giving me an issue and I don't have to sit there and, and put nails on. So I only, you know, did the nails that I needed to do. But sometimes, like, occasionally, if, you know, one should, if I was, Frosty, come on, buddy. Sometimes, like, if I've had one on for a long time and the, the glue gets a little weak, and then it somehow, you know, I'm a little too rough on it and it comes off. I'll just wrap it in a band-aid and I'll I'll attend to the part of it that's still glued to my nail. I'll take that off, I'll put on fresh, you know, whatever. Uh, so there's that. My cat is so vocal tonight. Buddy, what are you doing, little boy? And that is let me just check this external pocket, but I think I went through all the pockets in my bag. Yes, I did. So that is what was in my bag at this point right now and yeah it, it changes all the time I always have like such randomness in my purse you know such randomness I like to joke around a lot of times with my friends and say like you can strand me on a desert island and I'll have everything I need to survive so that's pretty much that um let me see if I can grab my kitty and show you come here buddy I want you to come say hi this is Frost. This is my little buddy who's been meowing off camera. He's my little boy. He's a good boy. And that's pretty much it for now, folks. Um, tag your it. I would love to see what's in your bags. Or, uh, fellas, maybe you could do like a what's in my pocket or what's in my book bag if you don't carry a, a man bag. <laughs> Some dudes do, you know? Um, but yeah, if you want to do a what's in my pocket, what's in my wallet, something like that, that would be fun. Or you could always do like what's in my altar cabinet. That would be kind of fun too. But anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you got a laugh out of the kind of things that I carry around with me. Cause a lot of people do usually giggle when they see what's in my bag. And that said, I... We'll see you guys next time. Stay cool, and I'll be right back at you with another video as soon as I can.